hey guys welcome back so in this session we are going to focus on date and date times in excel so let's get started so many times when we work on date we need to take care of how excel behaves on the type of data being entered so let's say i am entering so basically excel will accept date formats in the below session below formats so let's say you want to enter uh, 11 slash 11 slash 2018 so it will save as it is 11 slash 11 slash 2018 so what about 11 hyphen 11 hyphen 2018 so again it will save the same way as it is <coughs> however Let's say I want to type uh, another date which is which is being scheduled in the next 11 years say so what I will write is 11 slash 11 slash 28 so the date which Excel took the year is 2028 so let's say now I want to enter a date which is 50 years ahead of me so I have been I am going to enter 11 slash 11 slash 68 okay but see what Excel took is 1968 why because what Excel is programmed is with the set of rules and what does the rule suggest the rule suggests that anything so I will let's say I will taking 30 okay so 30 also gives me 1930 okay so the rule states that any any date with the year 0 to 29 okay will be considered by default in the current century okay whereas somewhere between 0 to 99 will be considered for in the previous century however if you want to just type 2030 then you can just type 2030 and your work is done so you need to be careful when you are trying to work with dates formats now let us come and check out the time frame okay so but you can set different time frames for example this time frame is a 24 hour time frame however you can always check or format this in a way that you want so currently it is 8 21 pm okay and this one is again 1 11 pm okay however if you go to this data you are not sure whether it is am or pm so this basically is am however you need to be sh careful when you are working with data as the data over here is not specified whether it is am or pm so it is better to go with 24 half format okay so that was it for this session like this video just give it a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel and hit the notification bell